I was watching in the shop the other day, you know, and I was walking through and I saw this, got this video idea because I saw these really weird ice cream. Check it out. I did the mac and cheese one, but I noticed, I realized that I don't have the cookie butter. I think I have like a, I have the holiday cookie and cream and one other one. So we're gonna make a little taste test video. See what these flavors are about a little bit. I brought the figure freezing over. No, I can't leave the shop without my fresh kombucha. Here are the two new flavors. We have here peanut butter fudge pretzel, holiday cookies and cream, and caramel sticky bun. We should add iced tea, ice, no, Thai iced tea. <laughs> uh, what else? Salted chocolate truffle. I wonder what king cake is. Let me see what that has in it. Radish pumpkin. Ooh. Ooh, that sounds that sounds uh that sounds great for the video. <laughs> The last two flavors I picked up, I got them. Thai iced tea, you see this king cake. This one, I didn't know what was really in it, but read the ingredients. I read the ingredients in the shop to check what was in it. Right there, you see a pumpkin sweet potato radish. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Canola oil, mm-mm. Yeah, this all, this all sounds very weird-like. Alright, so we have here all the flavors. I'm not sure if they're exquisite or not. You see, you see we have. Let me, let me show you, let me show you up close. We got holiday cookies and cream, cookie butter, caramel sticky bun, peanut butter fudge pretzel, craft mac and cheese, Thai iced tea, and king cake. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna rate them, see how they taste. Here is my magical spoon. So let's start this, shall we? First, we have the holiday cookies and cream. Let's see how it tastes. Ooh, it's like a little bit green and pink and black. Do you see? Oh, 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 it's too bright, it's too bright. Let me see, see if I can darken it. Um. Okay, you see a little bit of color there. So, let's give it a taste. Hmm, feel like some Halloween candy corn. Not holiday cookies and cream. And candy corn don't taste good, but you might like candy corn. I give it three scoops out of five. Next is the king cake. Ooh, look at the little colors inside. Look, see, look at the look at how look at the purple. I wonder what I thought those colors are. Okay, let's do this. Uh, okay, I always have trouble opening ice cream containers. You know what, let me go open all these right now. Ooh.
Too right. Tastes like my dad's milkshake. But uh, let's see if this thing tastes like the one I got from the restaurant that one time. Mm. Oh, it's like crumbly ice cream. Very interesting. Tastes like a wow. It tastes like a cinnamon bun with caramel sauce. It's okay. It's good. It's all right. I give it. I give it. <laughs> mm. Three scoops out of three. Let's continue. Those first three were an experience. Those first three were an experience. So, hopefully, this cookie butter it's all right because I don't I don't eat nasty things I would make sure I cook top level did the cookie butter do the cookie butter there's like some little brown chocolate lumps in it so let's give this a try Ooh. Ooh. okay a little bit frightening about this one mm. Good. It tastes good. Mm -hmm. It's like maybe a four scoops out of four. It's like cinnamon roll again. Mm -hmm. Strong. It's alright. I recommend. Next up, caramel sticky bun. Oh. Specific smells. 
Jangan juga tu Dah kita Sekarang dia Look Look alright Let's give this one a taste Let me see the scoop Just a little bit of ice cream Let's give this one a try It's like a caramel sticky bun I get 5 scoops out of 5 for the execution of this flavor So white I don't like ice cream too much Next So it looks like 2 more Peanut butter fudge pretzel Interesting And then mac and cheese I'll shut up Mom's gonna say look at that I don't eat mac and cheese because I might look like that We don't want that, so let's leave that for last. Peanut butter fudge pretzel. Ooh, there's some fudgy. Wait, I don't want it to drip out onto my table. Look, look, look at, look at how it moves. Ooh, ooh, it's like some fudgy liquids. Okay, this one is kind of nice though. I think I might like this one. Let's try it. Ooh. That one tastes good as brass. It's like peanut butter chips, you know, like chocolate chips. They make chocolate chips that are full of peanut, that are just peanut butter. That's just what it tastes like. It's exquisite. Five scoops out of five. This is the one. This is the one you should get because I know, I know that. I know that mac and cheese is not gonna be right. So let's, <laughs> let's do the final one. The mac and cheese. I stay away from mac and cheese. Mac and cheese, it may be called comfort food. But I find broccoli fried rice as my comfort food. So I don't eat this. I try to stay away from it. I try to make my belly big. I have to get brave. I'm frightened a little bit. Just for the title. Let's not do that no more. This one. Let's see. Two scoops out of five. The bracket flavor. No ice cream container should have mac and cheese on the, 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 the thumbnail of the ice cream package. No. Would not buy again. So now that all that we tasted all the ice creams. I don't know how you got this done. So now that we tasted all the ice creams, we need to make a milkshake with every flavor that I tried.
Mm. Four milkshakes out of ten. Not try again. But with my thought process, to allow such a milkshake to be existent on my location. Okay. Well, uh, that will be in the fridge for the next um, year. Don't worry about that, though. So, uh, there we have it. Or do we? No, I'm not just playing, playing. We have it. Um, the peanut butter fudge pretzel was the best, the best ice cream that I say, in my opinion. The best ice cream for you to buy and taste. It's delicious. The only delicious one. I will catch you on the next episode of One Troublesome Boy. Right, Ted.